Hey, what's up guys? It is Michael Panetta with Tech Examined, and in this video we have the Kalia Pro for the iPad Air. So, let's get started. So I did get this case at CES, and I've been dying to try it out, and I really... You saw in the video, that's pretty much as far as I got with even being able to check this out was them showing me the case. Now the company, I'm not even going to pre uh, pretend to be able to pronounce it. It's I-S-S-A-S-S-I. -S 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 and you can check it out. I'll put the link down below for the site. This thing is extensive to say the least. And it does a lot. Now the nice thing is uh, you can actually replace this case uh, and use the... Uh, iPad 2, 3, and 4, uh, as well as the iPad Air. Now, there is a, uh, a couple bolts or four bolts underneath uh, here. It's like a sticker uh, that you can take off to take those bolts off uh, to be able to get to that to replace this. So, essentially, you have a, uh, a stand that does a ton of stuff with it. And there is a little lock on here, and you can actually start by taking this off and this basically reveals the stand. Now, the reason why you take it off the start is because it actually sits behind the bracket here, and then you can uh, basically loosen it that way, and you're all set to go. Uh, I'll show that to you again real quick. Uh, when you put this on, it actually sits behind here, and it doesn't move or, or you know stand up if you're basically not using it. You can carry this around. They have other adapters for this that you can use uh, to carry this around, but it is locked into place and it's, uh, you know, it, it's nice in that way. So what we'll do is just going to put the iPad Air in and it's a shell case. It's very simple, uh, open design, you know, nothing special about that. Uh, they do have it uh, cut on the side here uh, low for, you know, uh, uh, what do you call it, a smart cover that you can put on that. So really what you want to do uh, ultimately is you can lock this into place. This will not move. That'll stay where it needs to. When you're ready to use it, you can unlock it and you can flip actually, flip down the handle here and you can pull this off by holding the end and did I unlock that? No, I did. And we're good to go. So you just go ahead and uh, just pull this down and your stand is ready to use. Now, the nice thing about this is you can go all the way back down and you can have it flat against the bottom and you can move it in any angle. Now this is, again, it is a very strong uh, stand here. So you just keep pushing that down as low as you need it to and move it to where you want. Now, as you're tapping it, it will move a little bit, but it's going to go back to this way that you have it set up. So that's really nice. Now, doesn't stop there. You can lock this into place if you want uh, while you have it locked all the way down and it won't move, but you can actually take this and slide it up. And I think it's three and go one and two. And I think that might be it to be able to set that up in a more uh, ergonomical uh, set. And um, you can flip it around. Now, the one thing is this does not lock while you're in these positions. So, uh, you know, if you move it around or it gets bumped, it'll drop back down. So just a heads up with that. And I believe it can go up to there after that. It, uh, it will come off. Yeah. So there is one, two, three, and then all the way down, uh, on that. So I don't think you really want to go up any higher than that. And you can spin that around in the landscape. That'll be your best bet, or at least one click down there. Whoops. Right there. And you won't be bumping this at the bottom if you want to spin that around. And it gives you a nice, uh, range on that. Now, one of the things that I like, and I'm going to use this for is like when I travel, I like to sit on a plane kind of like this. If I'm watching a movie, you can relax and look down on it. Now, again, there's, it's endless on this. They even have on the website, uh, if you want to put this all the way down, you can set it up like, so you've got rubber feet down here on the bottom and, uh, you can do it like that. If you want to type, it does make it a little bit stronger where it's not moving. Uh, as much because you actually have this braced to be able to do that. Uh, the, some of the other things that I remember on, from them talking to me about, uh, if you have it in portrait and you want to go up at a very high or basically straight up and down, you know, you, it will fall over. But they do have this neat little kickstand, which will allow you to brace that up into place, and that will hold it. So you're not going to have to worry about it falling over on you if you don't go... Uh, far beyond that. 
Now, the other nice thing about this is you can actually take this and spin it around and that actually gives you the option of going the opposite way. Now, what would you use that for? Honestly, probably not a whole lot, but if you're lying in bed and you want to sit this on your on your lap and you want to watch a movie, you can do it that way if you're lying back. I know that's a stretch, uh, but you know you can definitely do that if you want to. The other nice thing is if you're not using it, uh, actually it does not go down all the way, duh. Uh, so you have that ability to, to angle it down. What you would use it for, again, it's, it's up to you on, on exactly how you want to use it to be able to do that. So you don't want to go back too far on that. You're having the same issue you had before. So the option's there to be able to do that. And this is a very strong uh, base. It's, uh, I think it's a combination of aluminum. This is definitely aluminum or metal. This might be like a like a little lighter aluminum on that to keep it light. But without it on, it is uh, it's a, a little heavier. Uh, you know, you, you, you have the, uh, the, the thin case on there, so you still can hold it this way. So, a very nice design. Endless uh, ways to use this, in my opinion. And uh, it's definitely a good system. I think it's about 100 bucks. And uh, if you want to get uh, the uh, different shell for the iPad Air, or I'm sorry, the iPad 2, 3, or 4, uh, I believe it's 20 bucks on their website. And who knows if the price will be coming down. Uh, on that sure enough, you know, um, you know if it gets more popular they might be doing that But I think it's nice. Uh, I think it's perfect at this uh, Level right here where I have it down to the bottom click I can spin it around easy and do what I need to do and uh, move that around so a very nice design uh, Again, if you don't want to carry it around with the uh, with the plate You can take that off and just put that to the side and you're good to go however you can store it in here. You're not have to worry about it, you know, moving all around. You can lock it into place. It's not going to fall off, and it's all set. So I'm going to keep trying this out and uh, see if there's anything else I can figure out what to use it for and uh, let you guys know what I think. Uh, I want to thank the folks uh, uh, over, and the name is right here, I-S-S-A-S-S-I, -S 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 uh, for allowing me to use this and try it out. They do have a coming soon on the website for the iPad mini and because uh, everything is going to be obviously condensed down at the show as you saw in the video they did have it for the iPhone uh, but that was just a very beginning uh, development on that so who knows what's going to happen with that when it's going to be out if it is at all so thank you guys uh, for sending this out to me if you have any questions, hit me up down below. If you like this video, please be sure to hit that thumbs up button. If I miss something or you want me to see something, comment down below and let me know. As always, hit that subscribe button. If you're not already subscribed, you can get the uh, next video that I have coming out. And uh, I've got lots of stuff coming up. Uh, not enough time to do it all. I'm excited to get to it. So that is it for me. I will see you guys in the next video.